We don't make it. Some people pass away. So I think it saved my life. First on Fox, giving the gift of life. A family decides to turn tragedy into triumph after a woman is found murdered by her boyfriend over Christmas. Tonight, Ashley King joins us live in the studio to explain what the woman's children are now doing. Ashley. Well, Robert, although this family has suffered a terrible loss, they tell me that they have some comfort knowing that their mother will continue to live on. It was December 22nd, days before Christmas, when police say John Regalado shot his girlfriend Michelle Hensel in the back of the head, then turned the gun on himself. Michelle clung to life before passing away the day after Christmas. Out of all of us, I'm kind of the weakest one, so they're my two older sisters are really they're being here for me, they're watching over me, they're taking care of me actually. As the family gathers at Mission Park South Funeral Home for their mother's rosary, they have reason to feel some peace in this moment of pain. We passed on a piece of her to somebody else that in need, she saved somebody's life. That life belongs to 61-year-old Anthony Munoz. Munoz is Michelle's daughter's father-in-law, and he now carries Michelle's kidney. I was amazed, you know, I was, I broke down, you know, I I was happy and, and it was, it was uh, bitter and sweet. Muno says he's been on dialysis for six months and was prepared to possibly never receive a kidney. I was on dialysis for at least six or seven years before you receive a kidney. Most people don't make it. Some people pass away. So I think it saved my life. Michelle's daughter says her mother was a kind, unselfish person, and she knows this is what her mom would have wanted. Right before all of this happened, we all talked about what we're going to do like if something were to happen to us. All of us agreed on donating our organs. Although it doesn't fill the void. I'm trying to be strong. They have some comfort knowing a part of their mother will live on in another family member. Yeah, I know I'm sad, but I mean, it kind of makes me happy that she helped somebody. And I know she would, she would have been happy. And Michelle's family has set up a memorial fund to help pay for funeral arrangements. If you'd like to donate, you can head to our website, foxsanantonio.com.